So today I'm talking about a P0741 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a P0741 code? Well, it's a torque converter clutch solenoid circuit performance stuck off. And what does this mean? Well, basically there's a torque converter that's bolted to the engine and the engine sends power through the torque converter to the transmission, which then sets different gears and sends this power out to the tires. And located inside of the torque converter is what's called a torque converter clutch or TCC. And this torque converter clutch basically locks the engine to the transmission so that there's no slipping going on or anything like this when the power from the engine is going to the transmission. And this has a lot of benefits. It can increase things like fuel efficiency, the fluid's not heating up as much and different things like this but when you get a p0741 code the computer sent in a signal to this torque converter clutch to engage but for some reason it's not happening it's not working there's some kind of issue going on and so it's going to, have to be troubleshooting no why and so what are some possible causes of a p0741 code well the first thing that could cause this is low transmission fluid so if you can go check your transmission fluid some newer vehicles don't allow this it's all enclosed there won't be no dipstick but if your transmission does have a dipstick then it's a good idea to go check it be sure it's at the correct level there's no metal shavings or anything like this going on with it some people when they get this code they go have the transmission fluid changed which may or may not be a good idea if your transmission has high mileage on it and that transmission fluid has never been changed regularly sometimes that can cause issues when you go to change the transmission fluid this might sound strange and it might make sense just to change out the filter put all new fluid in there and everything like that and you can do that but just to let you know that can cause issues with transmissions that have really high mileage on them if the fluid's been changed regularly like every 50,000 miles or whatever it's supposed to be changed at then you won't have no issues but if that fluid's never been changed and that transmission's got a really high mileage quite commonly if you go change out the transmission fluid and you put new fluid in and a new filter you're going to get other problems so be sure to keep that in mind but like i said many people they go change the transmission fluid when they get this code which very likely is not going to help with this code but if possible be sure your transmission fluid is at the correct level because if the transmission fluid is very low then that could cause issues the next thing that could cause a problem and a very common one is that one of the solenoids inside the transmission has gone bad and this is usually the tcc solenoid or a shift solenoid or something like that if one of these solenoids goes bad then that's going to cause issues and so you can go and test these solenoids and be sure that they're working correctly that there's no issues going on with them there's some different ways to go about testing these solenoids you could test them with the multimeter and things like this there's some good youtube videos on that but the next thing that could cause this is a bad solenoid so the next thing that could cause this is the bad torque converter it might have just gone bad it just need to be replaced if you've gone through and you know there's no bad solenoids the transmission fluid looks good then the next thing to go and look at is going to be that torque converter it's because the next thing on the list is going to be a bad torque converter and the last thing on the list is that something's gone wrong with that transmission which can include a solenoid but there can also be other issues going on with the transmission which can vary between vehicles since there can be different types of designs but the last thing on the list is going to be a bad transmission. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a vehicle with the P0741 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me. I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you. Please click like. Please click subscribe. And have a good day.